Right, looked a couple more YouTube videos and done a little update to my uh, low power oscillator that I copied off of Lid Motor. Uh, some of his colleagues on YouTube have done a couple of other little modifications. In fact, they do lots of modifications all the time. But anyway, the modification I've done, copying one of, uh, it's either Illusion 1 or Backup Motor. Or Magnet Man 2010, I can't remember who it was, I'll put the link in later. Um, I replaced the uh, cable tie coils with a couple of these fellas. Um, they are, well, they're harvested from, uh, oh, I can't remember what circuit board it was, doesn't really matter. They're axial inductors, I think is the name. Um, I'll add it to the video if I look it up and see what it really is, what the proper name is. Anyway, I've replaced those um, cable tie coils with these fellas, because that's what they are. They're coils, inductors. Um, I've stuck them on my breadboard and you probably can't see them. I'll put some close-ups in anyway, but they're just there. I've used these orange wires to show where they come from. I've also added a little push-on, push-off switch that uh, I found in my junk box. And you can see that red LED is coming on and off at the moment. <coughs> There's not enough there to light the green ones at the moment because that's one of my practically dead um, batteries there. In fact, I'll just see if I can change the battery. Yeah, that's that battery in the uh, old meter there. Well down in the uh, replace position. Try this one that's got it's just into the good on there. There you go. So that little red red LED I found is obviously uh slightly more sensitive one than the green ones I was using. Anyway, the purpose of this little video was just to show that I've replaced those cable tie coils with these two little fellas, which as I say I believe are called axial inductors. I'll look it up and check. I bet all of that's out of focus and because I'm too close in. See, I was all excited about using those and getting it working and I forgot about the focal length of my camera. Let's 
just have a quick look, see if we can measure that. Get the shadow in the right place, so you can see, yeah, 1.258 volts. And they're both alike. see the green LEDs are light but the, the red ones are light. That's on what should I just say? Oh that's dropping away. <laughs> Point 0.6. So there we go replacing the cable tie coils with axial inductors. <laughs> 